You're here. Your food is ready. And have I not warned you to stop serving me this cost food of yours? Tell me what exactly do you want from me? How else do you want me to shock you for you to understand? Or do you want me to cut off your head before you understand that I'm serious? And this thing, this thing you're carrying in your hand, this is why you are misbehaving. What is the problem? What has, what has come over you? Why, why are you screaming? Hey, 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 are you shut up? Shut up! Keep your mouth shut! You don't even know all these things are happening. Keep your mouth shut! What, what has come over you? This is our... Hey, stop! 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 Come down here! Come down here! Come down here! Till this time of the night, I've been trying to call him. He's not picking up his calls, and oh, you sleep good, Timothy. Yes, um, hello, Timothy. I I'm sorry I'm calling you at this time of the night. I'm, I'm really sorry, but. Yes, I'm worried about my husband. He's not back and he's not been taking his calls. But when last did you see him, please? Wait, wait let me get this straight. You mean you all left the office at 4 p.m.? I have not seen him. I have been calling his line. He's not taking his calls. He's not returning the calls either. Timothy, please don't ask me to calm down. You need to try and get across to him. Just in case you get... Yes, just call his line, please. Let, let, let's know if he'll pick up your own calls. Please. It's okay, thank you. I, I'll just wait for you to get back to me, please. Thank you. 4 p.m.? Christ. So why in God's name is he not picking up his calls? Why? Oh God. Diamond, please just speak up. Just speak up. Just speak up. Ah. Nothing will happen to him. He will be fine. He will come back home safely. Nothing is going to happen to him. Nothing.
calling you. You're not. You, you weren't taking your calls. I, I was worried sick about you. Hey, yeah, yeah. Don't come close. Am I owing you? What do you mean are you owing me? For goodness sake, Diamond, I am your wife. I should be worried about you. If I don't if you don't come back home, I should call you. Are you asking me if if you're owing me? Hey, hey, woman, listen. I'm very, very tired. And time is not friendly right now. All I need to do is to go in there and rest. I'm sorry, I... I'm sorry, but... I made something for you earlier. Sh should I microwave it? Don't you think... you're becoming so stupid and foolish at this time? Your husband walked in at this odd hour and all you could think about is for me to eat. I can see you're not even thinking about my health. I'm sorry. Sorry for yourself. in this kind of situation? Why is life treating me this way? God, why? Since this journey is still death to us part. Oh, death. Come and take me. He wasn't like this. Where is this place? Why are we here? I want you to guess. Can you just go ahead and tell me? You know I don't like guessing. Mm. Mm -hmm. All right. This is your home. Your heaven on earth. Hmm? <laughs> Wait. Are you? Are you saying this place belongs to us? Exactly. What? <laughs> it's in. No, no, no. <laughs> Wait, you must be joking, right? All right, I specifically want to thank you for standing by me. Because your faith and trust motivated me to do this. Listen. I loved you yesterday. I loved you today. And I'll forever love you. And I love you till eternity. Come here. <laughs> oh, Thank you. Mm. Well, I, I'm, I'm still trying to. Can we go inside so you can see the interior? Allow me. All right. I mean, Jesus, I cannot 
not believe this. Oh my God, this is beautiful. <laughs> okay, I, I, I want to see what we have. All right. <laughs> Look at me, I don't know why. This is so nice. Thank you. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. I mean, this whole place doesn't even look like the pig. My love, I have journeyed to a lot of places. And I've met so many ladies. No one, I mean, no one has appealed to my heart the way you do. And on this special day, I want to let you know that you're my heart, desire. You're my love. You are my heartbeat. You are the woman that I truly love. And so I ask, Miss Mirabel Ikemba, will you marry me? I'm sorry, I... I don't think I can do this. I can't. Of course I will marry you! Mirabel, you yeah. mm -hmm. will you marry me? I will marry you! <laughs> Come on. Oh my god. This is How are you? Very well. I am deeply sorry I am still doing this. I had other chores to do in the house. But I promise in no time I will be done. Okay. Come on, honey. I should be the one saying sorry here for making you go through this stress. Just know that I love you. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love you too. Thank you. Mm. Meanwhile, why didn't you eat at the company's cafe since you said you were so hungry? Honey, I've told you. It's either your food or nothing. So what happens if I travel? I'm going to fast and pray. <laughs> <laughs> You're uh, crazy, I swear. Let me help you. Okay, so what do you want to do? This. Uh -uh. I don't want you missing a finger. Don't worry, do this. You get it. <laughs> <laughs> so how was your day, Jim? Very well. Okay. Uh huh. Go with the second one. Looking so hot. I know. For who? If I don't look hard for you, who else will I be looking hard for? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let me get water so we can wash that. Yes, super. 
God, why? Why me? How did my man become this mean? How did a sweet relationship like ours become so sad? What is going on? How did my heaven become so dark. Who is this? What are you doing here? Um, my love. Again. Please, I just... I just want you to touch me. Please. Touch you. Touch us, Holy Spirit. Eh? Touch us, anointing of God. My friend, leave this place! Go, go, go to do my meter son. Leave, leave now, leave! He, he's, he's sleeping. I, I, just, I just came in from his room. He... He has gone to bed, babe. You rebel. Babe, please, you haven't touched me since I took in. What changed? What did I do? Everything changed. Hey. Don't make me do that scene. You are a very cheap hole. Don't. So, sorry, what, what did you just call me? Exactly what I called you. Leave this place. Leave this place now! Leave! I... Holy Spirit touch. You can't fold your legs as a woman. Keep your legs. Close it. Mba. You want the touch. You want me to penetrate. Let that touch kill you. Yeah, and now. It's me. 
<laughs> it's me, your wife, the, the, the mother of your son. Please don't do this to me. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Please. It's okay. I, I will not do anything to you. Okay. I will not kill you. But you have to allow this substance to enter your ear. What will it do to me? Just hold on. You will know when it enters your ear. Calm. Just be calm. Damon. Damon, please, I'm not making you. I'm not making you. Damon, 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 please, I'm not making you. Damon, please, this. This cannot get into my ears. Damn it, please, I'm begging you, I'm begging you, I'm begging you, I'm begging you. Spare me. Please, just spare, spare me. Don't, don't kill me, please, don't kill me. Don't kill me, please, don't kill me. Don't, don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. Spare me. Ah! Ah! Don't, 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 don't come close to me. Stay away from me. What's your problem? Stay. Don't kill me. Just stay away from me. I, I beg you, please don't, don't. Don't kill me. Mirabel, what is your problem? What are, what are you doing with the cutlass? You were screaming, spare me, spare me. So I, I, I came to attack the person. And you heard it all the way from the room? How? What is your problem? Are you suspecting me or something? Is there something you are not telling me? What is going on? Allah. You mean you had such a dream? Girl, I was scared. Have you ever had a dream that felt so real? It felt like it was, it was happening. Like, I don't know how to explain it. I was scared to my bones. This is serious. Have you confronted him? How? What am I supposed to say to him? You want to kill? Come on. That would be a very big accusation, especially without evidence. Evidence? Uh-huh. What do you mean by evidence? What about a dream? And who takes a dream as an evidence? What are you saying? My point is, you have to confront him. <laughs> Courtes, ritualists, all of them, they get scared once they know they are being suspected. Are you sure? Very sure. You see, I am scared. <sighs> Babes, with the way you're talking, you're also scaring me, so calm down. You cannot be scared. See, see, you will not ask it as a question. You just throw it to him. I have this, I have this strong feeling that one of the rules in their confraternity, their ritual thing, is that once their wife gives birth, they should disassociate themselves with her. Yes. Mm -hmm. So tell me, how did you feel after that uh, encounter? <laughs> I felt good. Yeah. <laughs> I can feel it from your voice. Oh, stop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. You know what? What was that? I will want you to sing. Another beautiful, charming, romantic, and a special song to me. Oh, 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 stop, just hey, stop, hey, hey, stop. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Please do that for me. Okay. Mm. The meaning of my life. 
It's for the one I love. He's always in my dreams. Mm. He's my fantasy. The moment I saw you. Yeah, that is it. <laughs> that is it. The moment you saw me, I love that one. I have been waiting for that. Yeah. The moment so you saw me. I said, tell me what happened the moment you saw me. Stop that. Stop. Come tell on. me, come on. I fell for you. Ah! <laughs> I know it. I know it because I saw it in your eyes. Stop! <laughs> I would stop. That. Stop that. You're always making me act out of character. Stop! Don't you like it? I like? I know. <laughs> <laughs> so, when are we going for boat cruise? Next weekend. Oh, next weekend. I want you to be precise. Friday or Saturday? I think Saturday. Say it romantically. Saturday. Good. <laughs> Ideal. <laughs> oh my God. Thank you so much. Thank you. So welcome. So, come here. Mm. <laughs> All right. I have to be on my way now, okay? And where do you think you're going? Home, of course. Is there anything you want me to do for you? Remember I told you I prepared something before you said we should hang out? And that meal is not something I can finish alone. I don't have any plans of eating it tomorrow. I have another plan. So, so what, what are you insinuating? That you follow me inside and eat. It's going to be a quick one, don't worry. Women. <laughs> okay, good like that. All right. Let's go. For the food in advance. <laughs> You're welcome. Taste of your food. It's second to none. You keep flattering me 
anytime you eat from my pot. I can flatter a beautiful woman like you. So tell me, who taught you how to cook? My late mother taught me. Mm. Her name must be in the Guinness Book of Record <laughs> as the best cook in the whole world. <laughs> you can say that again. Uh huh. Hope you know how to cook. Because one day you will cook for me to eat. <laughs> And I bet you, when I cook for you, you ask me of my recipe. I never use that of your mom. <laughs> no way. No. Don't challenge me. I will surprise you. I can't wait for that day. I can't. Okay. I will surprise you. Mm. Take. <laughs> <laughs> Stop, don't be like that. Stop. All right, don't worry. Take this. Oh, come on, take it. Look at you. <laughs> okay. Take. I'm not like you, just take. Don't try anything funny. Don't try anything funny. I'm not. Don't. Mm -mm, mm -mm, I'm not like you. <laughs> Vivian. Thank you. Thank you for the meal. <laughs> Honestly, I enjoyed it. <laughs> You're welcome. The taste so nice. You're welcome. Anything for you, mm -hmm. but remember you promised to cook a delicious meal for me someday. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. I wow you that very day. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually waiting for that day. I will surprise you. <laughs> so is there any other thing you want? Or anything I can offer you? Oh. <laughs> I will want to rest my head in your bosom and feel so good. <laughs> mm. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. That is all. That is all. Come here. Come here, Mama. Anything for you? Come on, come. Come rest. Ow. Of my machine. It's fine. All right. Anything for you. You know the right? Mm. <laughs> this, this is heaven on earth. Oh wow. <laughs> you can say that again. I like your body. Thank you. <laughs> I want you to sing a love song for me. A love song that can put me to sleep. Okay. Mm. <laughs> okay. You are not alone. Mm. I am here with you. I do you far apart. You always in my heart.
Jesus. Your word says that we should ask and we would receive. We should knock and the door will be opened. Wherever they have tied my family, my husband, wherever they have said that we shall not live according to your riches in glory. Father, one Lord, we send the Holy Ghost fire into the abyss right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, send your Holy Ghost fire to them right now. Send your Holy Ghost fire to them. You said whatever is loose here on earth is loosed in heaven. Whatever is bound here on earth is bound in heaven. Father, I send your Holy Ghost fire. I send your fire to them right now in the mighty name of Jesus. You shall restore peace to my family. You shall bring salvation. You shall bring happiness. You shall bring joy. You shall bring multiple blessings to this family. Oh, I lose my husband right now in the mighty name of Jesus. I lose him right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I call on your name. I have served you all the days of my life. I have sent you from the north to the east to the west and to the south. Father, you shall bring glory to this family. You shall bring love back to this family. You shall bring peace back to this family. Oh, send your Holy Ghost fire to them right now. Send your Holy Ghost fire to them. You said whatever is loose here on earth is loose in heaven. Whatever is bound here on earth is bound in heaven. Father, I send your Holy Ghost fire. I send your fire to them right now in the mighty name of Jesus. You shall restore peace to my family. You shall bring salvation. You shall bring happiness. You shall bring joy. You shall bring multiple blessings to this family. Oh, I lose my husband right now in the mighty name of Jesus. I lose him right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I call on your name. I have sent you all the days of my life. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Lord Jesus, I call upon you. <laughs> Jesus, how dare you disrupt the peace of house? How dare you? I, 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 was, I was only praying. I'm calling on me. Only praying. Does this place look like a church to you? Does it? Touch me. If you won't sleep with me, at, at least eat my food. Woman, I do not want to eat your food. Not today, not tomorrow, and not ever. Come on. Uh -uh. Hold on a minute. Why are you forcing me to eat your food? Did you poison your food? Diamond, what is it? What exactly have I done to you? Why are you treating me this way? What have I done? I have stayed in this house despite being treated with so much content. Yet you, you wouldn't treat me right. What is wrong with you? You are wrong with me. You, Mirabel, you are wrong with me. Stay away from me. Is this too hard to ask? It is too hard to ask. I am tired. I'm broken. What is going on with you? I am asking, please. What have I done wrong? This is not you. Are you, are you a ritualist? Oh, 
Michael, I don't know. Sincerely, I, I don't know what I have done to him. I don't know why he has been treating me this way. He has... Yes, Uncle. I have tried severally. I have tried to have a conversation with him. He wouldn't say anything. He hasn't said if I've done anything wrong. He just keeps pushing me away. He doesn't even... He hasn't given me any reason. Come on, Uncle. How? I would never treat my husband that way. I... I love him very much. I would never think of cheating on him, let alone executing it. <laughs> it's been one year. You know, I... I didn't want to talk to anybody about it because I, I, I thought he was going to come around, but uncle... <laughs> it's getting worse. I am tired. I. <laughs> okay. Okay, Uncle, I'll, I'll wait for your call. Thank you very much. is like Eden. And in Eden, you don't smoke on that. Tell me, what is it for you? It is my wife. What about her? She constitutes a nuisance. I am no longer happy in my house. That is from one problem to another. Her nagging attitude is becoming something else. I am tired. <clears throat> have you tried having a conversation with her? You can only have a decent conversation with someone that is mentally balanced. What do you mean by that? Can we change topic? Sure. Why don't you go back with that, freshen up, and get ready for a special trip? That sounds good. allow him walk out of the house without answering your question. Because he hasn't gotten to the point of you raising your voice. Calm down. Take it easy. Is that calm down? You're asking me to calm down. I should calm down. If, if not that you are an adult, I would have whooped your ass like a child. I should calm down. In your own words, you said when you asked him the question, he was shocked. Mm -hmm. Don't you think it's a sign? A sign that he's guilty as charged. You see, I'm just trying to be prudent with everything I am doing. Prudent? Yes. The, the one with the vex me say, you see, I speak English. You're the young grandma for the matter. For this matter. Really? Prudent. 
<laughs> My friendship, I just hope and pray that prudence doesn't lead you to your early grave. God forbid. You better say that again. Say it. It, ha it hasn't gotten to going to the grave and somebody dying. Why you? It has! It has. It has. Ha. Why? Why are you doing this? Why? Okay. Please, help me find some this thing. A man beats up his wife just because she said, Darling, come and eat. Honey, come and make love to me. You think it's normal? You think it's normal? Listen, in as much as I'm not happy, this... What I share with my husband is for better, for worse. Ah. Yes. It's not like I, I'm, I'm happy with everything going on, but I can't just leave until I know what is going on. I have to understand what is happening. <laughs> this one is deep. Aremiti lo. Otiku otilo. Please, oh, auntie, ma, what is your consolation? I have placed a call across to his uncle. Yes, to have a talk with him, and I'm... I'm hoping things will get better after the call, and then I could also find out what the problem is. Ah, this girl. I feel like flogging you, I swear. A little marrying mommy. You need to be flogged. Uncle, what has Uncle to do in this matter? Hey! Lady Law, Mogbe Jadi, Mogbe Sa. Something is supposed to stand your ground before this matter goes south. You are involving Uncle. Ah, ah, no, Koyemi. What is wrong with you? I'll be fine. Dear yeah, IBC, I, I'm, I'm worried. I'm worried sick about my husband. I have not seen or heard from him since he left for the office. Yes. I have been calling. Initially, he wasn't picking up. Now the phone is switched off completely. <sighs> Can you just stop joking right now? You expect me to go to bed when I haven't seen my husband. I, what if something has happened to him? Missy, you know you're not helping at this point. You know what? Good night. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Yeah. She couldn't have been saying the truth. I mean, Diamond always, he comes back home every day. I, I am sorry for coming back by this time of the night, my love. I'm sorry. It's okay, I'm not upset. I was just worried that your phones were switched off, that's all. Please. No, 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 no. My love, please. Allow me to apologize to you. My boss sent me to a rural area, and I'll get him there. There was no light, no network. I had a flat battery. And I didn't travel with my power bank to power my phone up. I am sorry. Please. 
find a place in your beautiful heart to forgive me, please. You are just a big baby. You don't have to. <laughs> you know what? Stand up, it's okay. It's fine. Listen, I'm not upset, okay? I'm happy you're back home and back in my arms. You didn't have to go down on your knee to apologize. I'm sorry. But I want to make a promise to you. I will never sleep out again. No matter the situation, I must surely come back home. If there's any need for me to travel out of this city, trust me, she must go with me. <laughs> My goodness, your mother spoiled you silly. Come here. It's okay, it's fine. <laughs> okay, so I made something. I don't know, it's quite late. I don't know if you would want to eat. Are you the one asking this question? A food yes. prepared by my sweetest angel. <laughs> come on, I must eat the food. Okay, come. You just go upstairs. Okay. Yes. Have a rest. Mm -hmm. And then you come down. God. What is going on in my marriage? He has broken all the promises he made to me. God, you are the Alpha and the Omega. The restorer of things. Even if my husband has sold his hands in something evil, you have the power to bring him out of such devilish thing. Help me, Lord, for I am depending on your strength to survive. I want to uphold the prize of for better or worse. Help me, for I am losing strength. Um, good morning. I am. Um, I, I I was up all night waiting for you to. I am. Um, I, I tried to reach you, but your phone was turned off. What happened? I was worried sick about you. Is that why you accosted me? <laughs> Wait a minute. You mean it was a deliberate act? Of course, it was. A deliberate act. And what can you do about it? Of course I would do nothing about it, but you need to tell me why you got me worried sick. I was out here all night waiting for you to return and... You were somewhere. I mean, God knows where. Having fun. And you're asking me what I am going to do about... Diamond, what is wrong? What is wrong with you, for goodness sake? Are you expecting me to answer this question? Yes. You will answer me because I am your wife. I am sick and tired of this. Listen, you need to explain to me exactly why you were last night. Do not push me. Because I wouldn't want you to incur my wrath. Don't! Okay? Oh, well, let me see you. Because you... Are you stupid? Are you stupid? Jesus! Are you stupid? David! Jesus! Who's calling me? Hey. I want to 
wanted to add the last ingredient to the sumptuous meal I was making and then call you. But little did I know that you were thinking the same route. <laughs> How are you doing, big boy? Oh, wonderful. I'm almost done with the delicacy I'm preparing. Yeah, for the picnic. I hope you're ready for an adventure. <laughs> okay. I'll be waiting. But I had you scream. I think I saw a rat. So hey, hey, let me see. Let me see. Uh, hey. Babe, it's nothing. Oh it's... My goodness. This is what you're trying to hide away from me. It's a small cut. I mean, I'll just let me wash it off and. No, 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 no. Small cut like this can be the most dangerous. Huh? What happened to you? I was cutting a vegetable to make the soup and then I, I mistakenly cut my hand. Ooh. With this? Yes. Uh, what, are, what are you doing? Why are you putting the knife in your pocket? I'm going to dispose it. Nothing inflict injury on my wife and go scot free. Okay? Jesus. Listen. It's... Mm -mm, mm -mm. We have to go to the pharmacy right now. I have to get this treated. Honey, it's just a cut. I can actually just put salt I and water. I know. But I said no. Okay? Let's go. When we come back, I'll take up the cookie. What? Are, right? you, are you serious? I am. Honey, it's just a small Hey, 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 hey. Please, don't argue. Please. Let's go.
my goodness. Diamond just hissed and walked out on me. Not even a sign of remorse. He doesn't even feel my pain. The same man who used to care about me has suddenly turned into a beast. Little by little, it's happening. I am gradually getting to my destination. And soonest, my plan towards him will become effective. But there's something about him that is not yet clear. I'll quietly get to that part of the story. I will. I will. From the time that we met to the point of marriage has always been beautiful and the envy of all. A lot of obstacles have, have come our way but we, we have fought so hard. We fought through this, holding each other's hands. The world is jealous of the love we share. That's why it has brought a clog to hinder the sweet flow of our love. Darling, a lot has gone wrong in our relationship. But I take the blame. I take the blame for everything. I'm kneeling down here to humble myself before you and to surrender my heart, my soul, and my body to you as my husband. I beg you, if there is any way I have offended you as your wife, as your friend, as your partner, please find a place in your heart to forgive me. Your words are touching. Oh my God. Um. Mm. And the cake. So sweet as you. Thank you. 
I'm yeah. happy you're smiling. Yeah. Thank you so much. Come. Thank you. Idiot. You're very stupid for putting up this cheap show. Instead of you to think of what to do with your life, you're, you're wasting the little money I have in this hard economy. Listen, I'm going upstairs. And if I come down, I want you to clear up this mess. <laughs> Do I make myself clear? <laughs> Foolish girl. <laughs> I am seriously holding myself. Like, this tears is getting on my nerves. Oh, family, regard. Well, I don't understand. A man beats you up for asking of his whereabouts. And all you could think about is to sit down and prepare an apology banquet, a dinner, a party for someone who is supposed to be apologizing to you. And you tell me you are in the right frame of mind. <laughs> ah, I won't do it. Auntie Joe, should I call the psychiatrist? BC. BC, please, I beg you in the name of God. You know I'm trying so hard to get my family together. Please. See how I'm clapping for you. <laughs> I can't see how well you're handling it. Mirabelle. Mm. Omoto Doom, Omoto Shan, Omoto Rewa. Offshore, downshore, complete. You're not just beautiful, you're elegant. Men will fall at you off it. Just with the wind that you're no longer in this marriage. Busy. Yes, darling. I will not divorce my husband. Ah. I will advise you don't go that route. It is for better for worse. I will stay with my husband. So please let me be. My darling, have you heard the song? Never say never, never. Yes, never say never, friendship. Okay, fine, fine. Why don't you report him to the welfare department? Yes, because no man beats his wife in this era and gets away with it. You see, I will not report my husband to the welfare department. I am going to stay in this marriage with my husband. Really? Yes. I have persevered the whole time. I will continue to be here to know exactly what is going on. This is a spiritual warfare. Somebody is trying to take my husband Thank away. you. Yes. Spiritual warfare indeed. You took the words right out of my mouth. But my sister, all I can see in this man is ritualistic tendencies. I don't know why you won't allow me to handle this man. I will have shown him who I am. Ah! Husband, show him the other side of me. My husband is not a ritualist. I have said that before and I'm going to say it again. My husband is not a... Moreover, we don't even have an evidence. Why do you keep calling him a ritualist? Ah, under the evidence... Oh, Oh, Alara, it's written all over you. Seriously? Oh, Remy. <laughs> oh, Kareo. Mm. Ah. Who's there? <laughs> Who's there? Who's there? This guy is over. Mm -mm. Well, now. <coughs> Hold on. 
<coughs> the sky is over. <coughs> sky is over now. <coughs> what, what's this? How are you? What is all this? Are you are you drunk? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold it. Mm. Who is that man? Huh? It's, it's okay, let's Who go. is this man? Let's go inside, let's go. The sky is over. The sky is over now. Let's go, let's go. <coughs> Don't touch me that way. Sorry. Don't touch me. Okay. Mind where you touch me. It's okay. Let's let's go. The sky is over. It's, it's uh, di diamond, diamond, please just get a hold of yourself. Sky is over now. It's okay. Let's Come go. on, get out. Get out. It's okay. It's you get out. Yeah. You get out. We're almost there. You get out. Yes. <laughs> you get out. It's 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 this way. It's you this way. Out. It's here. It's here. Get out. It's here. Let's go. <laughs> What is really going on? What is happening to my husband? So Diamond has now resorted to drinking himself to stupor just because he is running away from performing his conjugal duties. But what could be his reason? Wait a minute. I think this is the best time to do it. Now that he's unaware of what is happening around him. Yes, I am going to satisfy this burning fire inside of me. I don't care. I don't care what his reasons might be. Sadly, are you talking about? Why? Why are you screaming? 
What is it? Too many questions. I'll ask again. Did you have sex? No, we did not. You came back home drunk yesterday. You were sweating profusely. And you threw up on your own shirt. I had to take off your dress and cleaned you up. But wait a minute. Even if we had sex, was that supposed to be a problem? Yes. Why, why do you find me so detasteful? Mirabel, get out of my room. So, sorry, what did you say? I do not want to raise my voice. Please, get out of my room. Okay. Is he really a ritualist? My darling, I was as shocked as you were right now. Sometimes I wonder if that man put him inside a bottle when you are struggling to come out. What is, what, what, what's the meaning of that? I know that you are still trying to find out if the case is a spiritual one, when all the signs are played out. Do you realize I don't have an evidence to conclude on what you're saying right now? At least I should know one or two before Jumping into conclusions, don't you think? Ah, uh, there she goes again, pissing me off. Can't you just see the handwriting on the wall? That man is a ritualist. Hell, what would have triggered fear when he found out that he was naked? Um, you know what? Um, I'll, I'll talk to you later, okay? I need to get something done right now. All right, bye. What if this man is not a ritualist? I mean, what, what if he's going through some sort of phase that he doesn't want to share with any other person? Diamond, or am I hallucinating? <laughs> ah, Mokanwoleni. So this is the reason why he doesn't want to have anything to do with his wife. He's the other woman. So he's not even a ritualist. He's a cheat. Missy, what is this you wanted to talk about? That you said you didn't need my husband to be home to have that conversation. 
I hope all is well. Oremi, my friendship. What I'm about to tell you, I don't want your husband to hear about it. Why would you want to have a talk with me and do not want my... You know what? What is the problem? I have been forcefully accusing your husband of being a ritualist. <sighs> May his name be priest. I'm glad you used the word forcefully. <laughs> yes, I mean, I'm happy that you're beginning to understand that my husband is not a ritualist. Mm. Yes, it was just a misconception of ideas, like I told you earlier. Ah. He's probably passing through a phase that makes him act that way. Faces. Yes. Or any face. Yes. Hey. hey. Think, and hey. Meanwhile, why did you have a change of mind? Ah. What happened? Uda. Uda, me Ah! Girl, mm? your husband is a cheat. Bisi, you know we've been friends for a very long time. Yes. Why are you doing all this? No, you're making me see you in a different type of way. Why do you hate my husband so much? What has he done to you? First he was a ritualist, now he is a cheat. What is it with you and my husband? What? Seriously? Yes, seriously. You don't believe me? Look at my eyes. Does it look like I believe you? Ah! One lawyer. They used you. Mmm! A long bummy. Fine. I saw your husband drop off a certain lady in her house. They were kissing and hugging. Ah! More one more more grow. A long bum. And you don't believe me? You know, before you called me, I really had something doing. I mean, I was preparing dinner for my husband. I can see you have a lot of time in your hands. I don't. I still have my food burning on my gas. If you don't mind, I would politely ask you to leave my house and go find something to do with your time. Give me Lole. Yes, Lole. Mm. Go! I need to go back to the kitchen. Oda, don't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> and it's one Bawi. Don't say I didn't tell you. I've said my own. I've said my own. Don't say I didn't tell you. Don't say I didn't tell you. Hey, one person. Eh? I don't know why you didn't even study mass communication in school because all the news in this life, you have it at your back and call. I saw your husband drop off a certain lady in her house. They were kissing and hugging. Ah, more one more more grow along. Did they have sex? No, we did not. That question and the way he panicked wasn't ordinary. Bad. Diamond. Stand up. <clears throat> what is the meaning? You of don't this? speak until you are spoken to. Why did you venture into ritualism? You better start talking. Because I am ready for you tonight.
Please, is that your village ancestor or your uncle's brother's sister's son? Jesus Christ. I believe I have been vindicated. Or do you still feel I have personal vendetta with your husband? Oh my goodness. So this is it. Ah. This is... <laughs> you know, I actually thought you were... I, I thought you just had something against my husband the whole time you were telling me this. <laughs> Thank God you said thought. Now you've seen it. Oh, I, oh, sorry, sorry. I, 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 is that your husband? Can you just stop, please? When I was telling you, you thought I was joking. So what are you trying to say? You were the only client I've worked on for a very long time without achieving anything tangible from it within that period. Are you implying that you do not like my company or what? What I'm saying is that you lied to me. This is not just a mere quarrel between you and your wife. My instinct tells me that there is more to this. Diamond. All I want you to do is just open up to me. Open up to me, let me help you marry your wife the right way. Most people that don't know me might think we are having an affair. Vivian, I am sorry that, that I am not honest to you. See, this is complicated. Then let's uncomplicate it. Hey! So this is it. This is the little nitwit that has turned you into a beast overnight. What haven't I done for you? What sacrifices haven't I made for you? What do you want? I am asking you, Diamond. You come home every night and beat me up to a pulp. You haven't touched me in the last one year. You don't eat my food. I have given you everything. What do you, do you want, my womb? I am done. I am done. Honey, honey, don't touch me! I'm... Madam, I'm sorry. Please, please. Please, I'm very sorry. Please. Finding me all appealing. Diamond, where did I go wrong? What did I what did I do to you? What did I do? Mirabel. I am I am not cheating on you. Vivian is just Shut up! You shut that thing you call mouth. 
you even trying to deny when you have been caught red-handed? You, you even have the courts to mention her name before me? Diamond, you are a dog. You are a shameless bastard. I am still under your custody because your uncle asked me to wait for him until he comes. But you know what? I'm done. Diamond, I am done. I am tired. I am broken. You can go ahead and frolic with her. I curse the day I set my eyes on you. Trust me, girlfriend, his uncle is the only person I am waiting for. Once he comes back, <laughs> I'll just hear what the useless cheat has to say and I'm gone for good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Does it look like I'm going to cry for that idiot anymore? Babes, I am done crying. The only thing that matters to me now is my... Oh, look at him smiling. <laughs> my dear, the only thing that matters to me right now is my son. You... Let me call you back. Okay. Oh, look at him smiling. You are smiling. Smile for Here Jesus. Can I have a word with you? Smile for Jesus. Smile for Jesus. Don't let the devil come close to you, baby. Smile for Jesus. Oh. Smile for Jesus. Smile for Jesus. <laughs> well, let's clap for Jesus. Let us clap for Jesus. Let us clap for Jesus. Let us clap for Jesus. <laughs> The only reason I have stayed back in this house is because of the respect I have for you. If not, believe me, I would have been long gone. Do you know what I went through in the hands of this man? There was nothing I did not do to make this marriage work. But this idiot seated here would not even let it happen. Am I going to talk about his continuous beating? His rejection of my food? Uncle, I was sex starved for a year and counting. I can't, I, I, can't, I can't even start to mention. And then to make it worse, he had the cuts to frolic with another woman and even denied it after I caught him red-handed in the woman's house. Huh. I'm done. I am completely done. I am not doing this anymore. I am leaving him. Diamond. Are you sure you're okay? How can you cheat on your beautiful wife? Eh? A woman, every other man, I envy of her beauty. Eh? Uncle, I swear. I never cheated on my wife. Oh, really? You did not cheat on me. <laughs> hey, hey. Uncle, you know what? I don't even have time to banter words with him. I am going to leave you and that is what will happen. I am not going to stay under the same roof with you. Honey, please, you don't need to leave. But believe me, I never cheated on you. Oh, well, you can go ahead and live with your lies. Die with your secret if that is what you want. 
uh, uh, diamond. Are you telling me now that your wife is lying? Is she lying? Well, that's no problem. There is only one way for you to prove your innocence. We all will march to the goddess of purity. Then there, you swear that you have never cheated on your wife. And your wife will also swear that she has never cheated on you. I hope you know the consequence. Any of you that are guilty will die. That's it. Uncle, Uncle, can we just get going already? Let's get going because I don't know what we're waiting for. It has not really come to that point. We, we don't need to march to the shrine. I have a confession to make. Then go ahead. Right. I was worried. Worried and scared. I was thinking you're going to change your mind. I almost did. Because what you're asking for is morally wrong. I know. I know. But you're the friend that I have. I believe you and I trust in you. That is why I am asking you to do this for me. I know you wouldn't want your friend to go into extinction. Would you? Diamond, do you think I'll be able to leave with this guilt? Bro, please. Go ahead and do it. The substance I gave to her lasts for three hours. Which one of our 30 minutes has gone? Please, don't waste time. Go ahead and do it. Mirabel. Please, find it in your heart to forgive me for this evil I'm about doing to you. Diamond, the moment she takes in, I'm leaving this country. Accepted. It happened two more times before she took in, but she never found out what happened. Aru! Abomination! Diamond! You mean you did all this? Hi! I am sorry. I did it when I found out that I cannot father a child. You are sorry. Diamond, did I? Say that you are sorry. I was scared. Shut up. You did this to me, yet you were melting out anger on me. <laughs> like I committed an abomination. You made my life a living hell. In this house. Because of your own stupidity. Jesus. Oh God. I'm not going to spend another minute under his roof. I am leaving. Because
Because anybody who can actually do this to a woman he claims to love can kill that person. You are a monster in human form. I am sorry. I was scared. Scared that you're going to leave me. All the maltreatment I gave to you was a cover-up. God. I stopped eating your food. I stopped sleeping with you. Because if I do any of those, trust me, I will be a dead man according to the custom and tradition of our people. Please. Babe. One more I, I, word from you, I will hit you so hard. Please just. You are a bastard. Stay back here, please. Don't leave me. Please. D don't go, please. Mark this today. For everything. For everything you did to me. I swear to God, you will pay. Sorry, babe, babe honey. Babe. I... Uncle, help me beg her not to leave me, please. Bayamo, you are a disgrace to your late parents and to our family. Nonsense. to give my body to his friend. He drugged me without, without even thinking of my health condition. God. It's fine. It's okay. The most important thing is that the truth is out. Yes. You are out from that cursed marriage. Trust me, you will come around. You see, I am torn. I am torn. I, I am broken. You can't be done. <laughs> My love. My love, please. You need to calm down. See, life they say is slow but steady. Just like a snail. Trust me, you're fine. Please. You'll come around. God, this is so painful. It's okay. <laughs> You see, this is so painful. It is so okay. It's okay. Please. It's okay. <laughs> You'll be fine. Trust me. You're a strong woman. Remember? <laughs> 